Welcome back, True Seeker. March 1st, 2020. Again today, TMZ breaking news about a death in the world of celebrity. And in this case, it's a reality TV star, Tyler Cameron, who competed in season 15 of The Bachelorette. It's his mother that has died unexpectedly and brought about what they've called a family emergency. And look at the way TMZ broke the news. Bachelorette star Tyler Cameron looks distraught after mom reportedly dies. I mean, what kind of story is this? Wouldn't most people look distraught if their mother died? Before we go any further, I just want to remind people that TMZ, this news network run by the you-know-whos, they're always the first to break the news about celebrity death. And you got to ask yourself, how is that possible? We're going to be talking about the Masonic code of letters and numbers that is Gematria, which comes from Kabbalah. Kabbalah states God created the world with letters, numbers, and words. And again, Masonry is based in Kabbalah. It's a Jewish practice. Again, Kabbalah is Jewish mysticism. Gematria is Jewish numerology. But, you know, I think this picture sums it up here really well. Jewish man in front of the Compass and Square who works for TMZ. This screenshot was from news they put out about the death of Jews world, which was a reported death by the numbers. Covered it very thoroughly at the time. And just remember, with regards to this death, which we're about to get into, the mother of Tyler Cameron... This is the second death reported in the news by TMZ. January 23rd was the first, March 1st the second, the second death in relation to season 15 of The Bachelorette. So, today's date, March 1st, 2020, it's a date with 44 numerology. The last Bachelorette news story was on January 23rd, 2020, a date with 44 numerology. And... The man who was reported dead that day, Tyler Gwozds, however you say his name, has the Gematria 44. Also 64, like kills 44 and 64. The day he was reported dead had 64 and 44 numerology. Today, 44. Again, it's like clockwork when you learn this code, the way people are reported dead in the news. Now, I told people to circle this date of January 23rd, 2020. Long advance. On that same day, you got the death of the only Scottish basketball player ever, Robert Archibald, and they reported he played in 44 games. You had the death of Jim Lear, who was part of the PBS show, with the 44 Gematria. Anyhow, 44 date, once again, another person dead from the same season of The Bachelorette. Well, in this case, it's not the actual contestant. It's the mother of the contestant. They point out that he was in Jupiter, Florida, when this news was broke. I just want you to see how Jupiter, Florida has the same gematria as Jewish. And I want to remind people about July 4th, 2016. That was the day the Juno probe landed on Jupiter. And Google Doodle did this tribute. This is supposed to be the Juno probe. Notice what Google spelled with their tribute to the Juno probe landing on Jupiter. Goy, the derogatory term for a non-Jew. 7-4, Jewish 74, Jupiter, Florida 74. Mm. Anyhow, the story goes that on February 27th, 2020, Tyler Cameron put out a tweet that something had come up with his mother, an emergency. And February 27th is the 58th day of the year. The name of his mother is Andrea Cameron, which equals 58. So something happened to his mother unexpectedly on the 58th day of the year. You ever heard that phrase, your number's up? Has a lot to do with this code. February 27, 2020 was a date with 15 numerology. He was in season 15 of The Bachelorette. Notice right now, Tyler Cameron is 27 years old. He turned 27 January 31st, 2020. That means that from his 27th birthday to February 27th was 27 days later. 
and you're probably familiar with the 27 Club, the number of deaths that have come to entertainers at age 27. As I pointed out, the 27 Club goes beyond just dying at 27. You see a lot of people who are 27 lose someone close to them. You see a lot of entertainers who aren't 27 years old die on a 27 date numerology or 27 days from their own birthday. 27 shows up a lot. Ritual equals 27. And the day after the emergency, February 28th, he was scheduled to go on Good Morning America, but he had to cancel his visit because of what happened with his mother. And no news source is making it clear if his mother died Thursday, February 27th, or Friday, February 28th, but most news sources are alluding to the fact that she died on either one of these two days. Now, if she died on February 28th, that's the 59th day of the year, and Tyler Cameron's 59. And remember, Freemasonry is 58 and 59, which is based in Jewish mysticism, which is Kabbalah. And in light of the fact that TMZ does all of their news stories by the numbers, it's no doubt that they're part of this cabal. Again, just look right here. Your eyes aren't deceiving you. The Freemason Compass and Square, the you-know-who. February 28th, 228 might have been the day that she died because death does equal 228, a number that we talk about often in this code of murder by numbers. If you run the alphabetic order in reverse, Tyler Cameron sums to 67 instead of 59. That's the blood sacrifice number. Could be why he was chosen for this ritual because he had fateful numbers in his name. His mother's name, the first name alone, Andre, is 38, like Florida, where she supposedly... Well, actually, it's unclear. He's in Florida. His mother might have been in New York. Anyhow, Andrea, Florida, death, all 38. When you write out 15 as a word, it's 38. Again, it's season 15 that he was in. Don't forget this movie poster, Murder by Numbers, where only two letters are changed to numbers, the E to a 3 and the B to an 8. Murder 38. Murder is also 83. The song Murder by Numbers came out in 83. Again, look up the lyrics to that song if you never have before. It's about killings the sport of the elite. It's as simple as A, B, C, 1, 2, 3. Sandra Bullock, the star in that film's 83. Words like killing, death, R.I.P., all 38. Gematria, English, 38. Kabbalah, 38. Jew, 38. Again, Gematria, the practice of coding numbers into words from Jewish mysticism, Kabbalah. The song Gematria, the killing name, was put out by the band Slipknot. The first member of that band died at age 38. Again, talking about the same numbers all the time. And... They say his mother was 55 years old. Remember, number that shows up again a lot. We just talked about this in a big way with Kobe Bryant. Tyler equals 55. Blood sacrifice is 257, the 55th prime. Satan equals 55. Again, there's that term, Faustian bargain, about selling your soul for material wealth and gain. So what's going on in the world of entertainment. Kobe Bryant died on the 257th day of the Boulay's age. Boulay's 55, Sigma Pi Phi, their official name's 55. They had the memorial for Kobe on the 55th day of the year. His wife's birthday is May 5th. He died 38 weeks after his wife's birthday. The uh, show, season 15 of The Bachelorette, it concluded July 30th. From the day it concluded to the day something happened to his mother was 213 days. Death is 213 in the Satanic Cipher. Again, Satanic Gematria, Synagogue of Satan, False Ones. His mother, 55 years old. Don't forget that when uh, Tyler Gwosed, or however you say his name, the news was January 23rd, but the death was January 22nd, 122, like Satanic's 122. Same with San Francisco's 122 on the 122nd Meridian. The Church of Satan established in San Francisco. His surname had that Gematria 38 as well. So, and again, talk about the same patterns month after month. Tell people what dates to circle to look for the deaths. The 44, 64 dates, always clockwork. Also, the contestant who both men, because both of these men who now have connections to death, Tyler Gwoz and Tyler Cameron, both of them were in this same season competing for Hannah Brown, whose name is also 55. And if you use the alphabetic order, her name's 118, like death in Jewish gematria. Brown alone is 27, like how this young man just lost his mother at age 27. 
possibly 27 days after his birthday on the 27th of the month. So, again, Gematria tells the tale. If you're new here, definitely look up the lyrics to the song Murder by Numbers by the Police from 1983. But, uh, again, sadly, this goes on all the time. If you want to learn more about this code, come to Gematria Effect News. You can read all the categories that are under Murder by Numbers. If you're on your cell phone, you scroll to the bottom of the screen. There's already a lot of posts. I just launched this website January of this year. And um, if you want to read my book, the longest chapter in the book. Again, the book's nearly 800 pages long. The longest chapter in the book, chapter 20, Murder by Numbers. And um, it's over 150 pages long, that chapter alone. I made it the 20th chapter because death equals 20. Like I said at the beginning of the year, 2020 would be a rough year for celebrities, and it certainly has been. Deaths left and right in the world of celebrity, world of entertainment. All right, we'll leave it there, True Seeker. Till next time.